today guys it's going to be an amazing day hopefully guys we can find something great if not as always we've been blessed and we've been blessed with a lot more so guys let's get started with our dumpster diving adventure all right let's see what we have over here Got a bunch of like look like dog toys. Yeah. Oh lamb chop. How many of you guys remember lamb chop? Where this is lamb chops, play along, where kid comes and play along. And everything you do with Sherry. Remember lamb chop, you guys? Well that's what this is. Lamb chop. I see a table back here. Nice looking table, and they even left the legs too for somebody to pick up. Mm. Yeah, it's, that part is broken. So I just hear the guy ask me, you guys, how, how can you be so happy? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just happy, it's the God in me, 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 honey. He said, how can you be so happy? I don't know how to answer that question. I don't know, just happy. And I'm going to go back and I'm going to give him this scripture. Just so happened Haley left her Bible in the car. And I'm also telling him to follow me on, on YouTube as well. Let me go back to this guy. Come here. Okay. So you just asked me a question, right? You said, what made you ask me that question? You, oh, because I was saying, yeah. so do you believe in God? Yeah. You do. Read this. I want you to read John 14 and 27. And this is why I'm always happy. John 14, 27. Right there. Yep. Did That's you? good. So when you got God with you, you're always at peace. You have nothing to worry about. You know, I'm not a religious person. Yeah. Like you are, but every one of my friends that's religious. Yeah. Is like you just always at peace. Yeah. It's awesome. It's, it's just great. something about the word of God. When you know that he is with you, you don't have nothing to worry about. Thank you for sharing that. You know, what's your name? Alex. I'm Angel. You, t Angel, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You too. take care. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I didn't give him a car, you guys, because I just didn't feel moved to give him one, but. He said it's, he's not a religious person, but everybody that he knows who's religious, they always <laughs> are just like I am. When you got the Lord on your side and you got God in your life, you don't worry about nothing or nobody, okay? I'm always at peace because I know the Lord will be with me. I don't have nothing to worry about. He will order my steps every time. And with patience and virtue and wisdom and knowledge. Everything else in this world don't mean a thing, honey. Okay? All right. 
Let's finish working. Look at this. This is nice. This is nice. This is nice. And I might have to take it. I might have to take that, y'all. That's nice. Yeah, I like this. Oh, it's messed up right here. Well, yeah, it's too dirty. I'm not taking it. It's too, too dirty on this side. Dang. Plus, I didn't even know what I would have done with it. Would have just donated it to the church. Yep, so put it back up. Mm. I have this remote control, you guys, but the back of it isn't in here. And I see another one in there, too. We got this Classic Games Casino they got at. Look like uh, TJ Maxx for nine ninety nine. Take that game. Here's another remote. Here, look, another one without the back on it. I don't know if I can do anything with those. Cardsagainsthumanity.com. Let's see. Puppies. A party game for horrible people. Okay. I'll take it. I'm always trying. I'm always looking for nice games to play when I'm with friends. Here is a candle, you guys. Still got some little life left in there, a little usage. Then I have this Netgear router that can probably still be sold. Bunch of Tupperware in here. Looks like we have more games here. A 1,000 piece amusement parks of the world puzzle. Some, some bull, Chicago Bulls pants here that I can keep. What size are they? A medium, yep. I can wash those out and keep those. We have this Nike jacket here. Donate that. No more pants in here, y'all. And we have a shirt there. Some pants that can be donated. Banana Republic. Uh, Old Navy shirt. This is a Eddie, big old Eddie Bauer duffel bag, you guys, that can probably sell. If not, I will donate it. stuff in here you guys look like this is a hot plate some garbage bags it's a Vaughn shelf all right you guys I came over here because I saw some couches out here look at these couches nice couch oh a really nice couch too Look at all of this stuff, you guys. 
Look at all of this stuff. Somebody threw out all of this good old stuff. We have furniture, we have beds, storage container. A lot of this stuff is soaking wet from the rain. We have a television over here. I don't see anything over here that's worth taking though. What's this? Toilet bowl. Toilet tissue roll holder. Nah, nothing over here that's promising. Let's see what's back here. That's it. Nothing over here, y'all. Let's keep going. Just looks like it's a lot of stuff, good stuff, but it's not. This is a nice looking mirror, you guys. Pretty decent looking mirror. Let's see. Oh, it's a standing mirror, too. One that I wanted for my living room, y'all. Unbelievable. Only thing is, it's silver. I want it gold, but I can easily go get some gold spray paint. And put that in the living room, honey. Let's see if it'll stand. Oh, yes, honey. There it is. Sooky, sooky. I'm going to take it. I don't even have to buy a mirror, y'all. Look at that. Yep, I can spray paint that gold. Boom. Save myself some money. Yeah, buddy. Uh-oh. Voila. All right, you guys, I see some stuff down here. stuff right here y'all what is all of this look like some good stuff put on our gloves let's see i hope a lot of it isn't damaged because of the rain we got some tide pods right here cool could take that i'm gonna just take this stuff over here because trying to look at it on the ground is kind of difficult Take it over here, open the bags, and then dump it in the garbage can. I don't see anything in here. The George Foreman grill, you guys. Let's see. Here we go. Oh, that's a pretty clean grill. I'll take that. Somebody might want it. I don't know if it's supposed to wobble like that, but I'll take it. I'm sure it's working. I'll take, it's wet. Ooh, it's really, really wet. Look at that. Like the rain really got a hold to this. So I'm gonna, I'll leave it up there for the scrappers. Looks like some sitting chairs. Yeah, I believe that's what these are. 
Just some chairs. This is, yep. Some chairs. I'm hoping there's some really good ones. Some that recline and all of that good stuff. Let's see. Oh no, those are all messed up. I don't want those. Oh good, I got another spray bottle. I don't have to buy one. I love this. A continuous mist spray bottle. I love these. Good. I don't have to buy one. Sammy walks around the house and spray it like a spray gun. So, and he drops it all the time. Take that stuff. Look, we have a, a Oscars, Herschel Oscars bag. Look, still with the tag, never been used. Limited time, limited lifetime warranty. A Herschel bag. Somebody might want this bag, y'all. Herschel is a great brand. So I'll take that. Thank you. Oh, doggy. Look at all of this water. I saw this plant sticking out of here. That's what made me come over here and see. Oh, it's a fall plant. Just as I assumed. All right, I could take that. I'm sure somebody would love to have that. I think I see another full plant down there. Yep. Another full plant here. A full tree. Let me get that other little piece that was there. There it is. Goes right there. There we go. Voila. We have some shoes sitting up here, y'all. Decent looking shoes somebody might want. Some downy tied I can use. Some long. Yep, yep, yep. Here's a candle with some boobies on it, and it says pink ribbon, pink ribbon foundation. I'm gonna take that. Here's a ring. It's tarnished, so it's not real. Cashmere Try to Club sweater. Nice looking sweater. Equinox shirt. What size is it? A small, medium. I can fit that. Here's some. Workout clothes, a medium, we'll take those. Are these some Lululemons? Some of Lulus? Let's see. And that, some regular, regular, some regular schmugglers. Another ring right here. This one has a writing in the inside, so I'm gonna take that. 
And we have these. But they're so messed up. And then they are not white. Purse here. Nice looking purse that somebody might want. Oh, let's see. Oh, it's broken. Well, yeah, it's broken. Here's another purse here. With some coins in it there. Oh, oh my gosh, what happened to Virgil? Look at all those coins, y'all. That will be going in the bank. So I'm gonna take this purse. Thank you. Uh, Dana began. Okay. There we go, y'all. I think I see another purse right here. Sound like there's some change in there, too. Yep, it is. She just put a lot of coins in her purse and then just throw the purse away. Okay, friend. Thanks, girl. Let's see. That's change. Yep, look at all of that change, y'all. Look at all that change. Thanks, girl. Shoot, man. Let's see. Did you, did you leave some dollars in here, too? You throwing change away like it's nothing, honey. And all of this money can spend. All right, what else is in here? All right, let me go put this stuff on. Okay. Bunch of plates. Somebody can use these plates. Okay, guys, we are finally home. And here's all the items that we were able to find today as well as the items that I found on Monday's live, okay? I'm just gonna do a quick recap of the stuff that I found then, all right? So let's go ahead and get this party started. First thing first, let's go on over here to the right. We're gonna start on the ground first and then we'll work our way up to the table, okay? Now, over here, you guys, we have some DVD or cassettes, all right, or discs. Down here, we have our bags. We have an Eddie Bauer bag and then we also have a bag that says bridal shower. Over here, you guys, we have um, some white sh uh, sheets that will be getting, getting washed. Hopefully, they are the size for my bed. And if they are, I will be keeping those. Down here, you guys, we have a lamp, a professional gel polish lamp down here. Back there, you guys, we have puzzles. We have games. We also have a router. We have some um, Xbox controllers there. We have a swing speed radar here. Over here, you guys, we have our chef pants. Down here, we have a dart board. Back there, we have a fan, two fans, actually. Right in here, you guys, we have a grow lamp. Right here, you guys, we have an exercising headband. Back there, we got, back there, you guys, we have some Nature's Miracle uh, Odor Control litter box liners. We have this really cool blanket right there that was soaking wet down here you guys we have all of our kitchen uh utensils we have a, a heating pot we have some dishes we have a cooking camper stove right here we have a strainer we have a neutral bullet motor here down here we have our shoes and our belts we have some swimming suits right here you guys one of these swimming suits this one in particular it's brand it's new never been used because you can still see the crouch liner right there and these here are pretty clean no stains in the crouch area over here you guys we have our purses filled with coins we will count the coins later over here we have our mirror and our faux plants and over here you guys we have 
our detergents, our cleaners, and my hairspray bottle here. We have an array of clothes right there that will be getting washed. This section right here I will be keeping, and this section over here I will be donating. We have a few bags right here, bowls, Herschel, and American Tourist. And then we have this Cards Against Humanity game. Antoine and I played this a few minutes ago. It was really fun. He said, now this is a game I would love to play. We have some Converse shoes here. We have these Call It Spring Vegan leather shoes here in great condition. We have some Mary Kay sunscreen here that I will be keeping. Uh, we have some glasses here. We have some stainless steel pads. We have a bunch of sample uh, perfumes right there. We have a apple cord right there this is some cardiovascular support they were never used never opened nature's bounty some um antiseptic to wash right there we have some flat irons some stick pins a bun roller here some earrings from target a few cigars there over here we have our candles some beautiful pillows that i'm going to see how they look in my living room and if they're great i will be keeping those and then we have this cool looking mirror you guys now i did test the fan earlier today when i walked in and the light they are both working you guys so let's go ahead right now and count how much change we were able to score and then i will go ahead and put that in my bank as well as uh the other money that i have in my fanny pack i will put that in my bank as well okay so let's go ahead and count that up all right so we have money in here you guys and in here let's go ahead and dump it all out All right, now let's go ahead and get all the coins out of here. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, one dollar, one dollar, one, two, three, four, five six dollars and 17 cents now let's go ahead and get the change that i have in my fanny pack so let's see all right you guys so this is what we have total we have one two three four five six seven eight nine 10 11 12 13 14 dollars and 17 cents all right, you guys, so here we go, here we go, here we go. This is what I did with the mirror that I found. So it's gonna be out with the old and with the new. I actually just put this one in here just to give me an idea as to how a mirror will look right there. And I'm so glad that I found this particular mirror because I wanted one to go in this corner, but I didn't want a big one. I needed something that will fit nicely in this corner. And I think that's perfect. So what I need to do, I'm going to go ahead and take off the little stickers right there that some little kid put on the mirror right here. Uh, so as I was, you know, uh, saturating the stickers with water so I can go ahead and take it off, I just realized what it says. Angel! Aww. I should just keep it there. Nah. So there you have it. You have the pillows and the mirror. I think it looks great in this space, you guys. And once again, it's a blessing. I'm so glad that I was able to find all of those amazing decorations. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> So guys, that is it. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please do remember to like, comment, subscribe, share. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. Make sure you leave comments down in the comment section because I enjoy interacting with you guys. Also guys, if you are not aware, I have another YouTube channel. And on that channel, guys, you will see my family and I interacting with one another, as well as me doing various things that I decided not to do on this channel. So guys, if you're interested, make sure you look down in the comment section. I left the link for you there. Also, guys, I am a published author. That's right, guys. I 
have a book, a book, a book, a great book, guys. Um, and I would love for you to check it out. Make sure, guys, you check your local Barnes & Noble. You go on Amazon and look for the title, Finding Your Treasure. And guess what? The book is even an audiobook with Google Play as well as Audible. Again, look under the title, Finding Your Treasure, and you will be able to see my book. And as always, guys, I'll see you guys in the next YouTube video. I'm on a mission to serve in whatever capacity the Lord sees fit. I had no idea I'd globally impact the world. I took what others threw away and positively changed minds. People in France, Qatar, the Philippines, and other countries are now following me along on this journey.